What's up guys? David Land here bringing you the 12th race in my NASCAR 15 Let's Play and the second road course of the season, Watkins Glen International. This is a fantastic circuit and I can't wait to take to this track and try to get my very first win of the season here at the Glen. If you missed the last race at Indianapolis, I urge you to watch it. It was not only a fantastic race, but there I ran a very special paint scheme in honor of the late IndyCar driver, Justin Wilson. Definitely check out that race before you come to this one. Uh, click that card in the corner to do that. If you're new here and want to check out the full NASCAR 15 Let's Play, uh, hit that card in the corner right there. It'll take you to the playlist of all the races that I've done so far, and you can choose which one you want to start with. Uh, no crew chief for today, no one sent me a setup for Watkins Glen, but as we saw at Sonoma, setups really don't matter. Uh, you just need, uh, you know, to have, be a skilled road racer. Um, but if you'd like to send me a uh, setup for the last race before the chase at Darlington, I know a few people have already sent me uh, those, so I'll have to do some test sessions to figure out who's the fastest. Uh, but if you'd like to send me one at Darlington, or the first chase race, which I'm not necessarily sure, um, that I'm going to get into Chase uh, at Chicago Land. So both of those tracks uh, send me setups on social media. Uh, and now here come the spoilers, the point standings as they run after 12 races. Martin Truex has taken back the points lead. He had a decent race in Indianapolis. Uh, he took the pole, but uh, none of the points uh, contenders were really in, in the race at Indianapolis. Uh, Harvick second. Kyle Busch third, the first real shake of his Vickers passing Allgaier for fourth. Johnson, Menard, Newman has snuck up finally, the first time he's broken into the chase contention, and of course it's the late season. Uh, Ryan Newman, uh, even in NASCAR 15, has a tendency to sneak into the chase. Jeff Gordon is ninth, and Carl Edwards back into chase contention uh, and tenth. And the guys on the outside looking in at the moment are Biffle, Larson, Logano, and I moved up to 26th in the standings. There's an outside chance of me getting into the chase still. I do believe I need a lot of luck and I need some wins. So without any further ado, guys, this is Watkins Glen. Such a, oh, I almost forgot. <laughs> the paint scheme I'm running uh, is, is very important. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you what I'm tributing, but I got caught up in the Darlington throwback fever. So it's a throwback car and it's a road racing car. That's what I'm tributing here, but that's the only hint I'm gonna give you. That hopefully this one will actually challenge the people and not be like the Jimmy Vassar tribute I did at Michigan and be uh, gotten on the very first try. But uh, maybe it'll be hard, maybe it won't be hard, we'll find out. So it is the Glen. It's a road race, the last one of the season, uh, and hopefully I can pull out a miracle win and hopefully can get closer to the chase. You're watching David Land on YouTube. Qualifying highlights are next. All right, here we go, trying to get in, uh, making one last ditch effort. I'm 35th right now, trying to get in to the top. I think it's 22 to get to the next round of group qualifying. Oh, lock the brakes up in the first corner. Bad, 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 bad. Brad Keselowski picks up the pole position for the race. Uh, you can go down through the rest of the field, find your favorite driver. Uh, unfortunately, it's a 37th position start for me. Not the best place to start at a road course, and I'm ahead of all the front row and BK cars. Well, at least that's something. All right, here we go. Watkins Glen, what's going to happen? Hopefully, it's something good. Watkins Glen, the second and final road course of the season. What is going to happen here? The, my season is essentially on the line right here. What will happen? What can I do? Can I get myself positioned to get near the chase? The green flag is about to come out here at Watkins Glen. And we're waiting, racing. We're going. Green flag at Watkins Glen. And they're stringing out already. Chase Elliott causing a, a massive stack up there with... Uh, McDowell, rolling, you got to break so early into the first corner here. They're stacking up. Oh, cars going to the outside. 
a big move by Witt down to the inside. Newman to the outside. I'll tuck in behind. I'll forget to shift. Trying to get to your corner. Oh, that was almost disaster. As uh, I almost got turned there by the 43, and he got into Regan Smith somehow. Everybody avoided a big wreck there into the bus stop chicane for the first time. And I've completely blown it. Oh, did I completely blow it? No, not too bad. I gotta avoid time penalties too. That's another thing. Oh boy. Oh boy. Regan Smith about Regan Smith me. Oh, and uh, the 43 does. And a little retaliation. Now we get the yellow. Man, I'm not really sure what was going on there. Just everybody piling in. A few cars pitted, so I'm not completely stone dead last, despite the fact that I'll probably start the title of the field. Uh, we're getting ready to go back to the racing here. Hopefully, uh, take two will be a little bit better than take one. How about that, folks? Boy, it's such a long time to get these things back going. Uh, it's such a slow start, and we're going again. No wheel spin, but they uh, they left me for chips. Oh boy, where am I gonna be able to go? Looking really good, buddy. Into second. Do I need to get into first? Well, I got into chase, but not in the first gear. Didn't need to. Uh, made a good move there. Yeah, that'll work. Into the S's for the second time. Good corner. Good corner. Mears, McDowell, and Waltrip all up there. Looking very takeable. 180 miles an hour. Had to get out of it. Wasn't really sure what McDowell was doing. Still not really sure what McDowell was doing. Oh, not sure what Yaley's doing. Really? Again? And Riello again. Oh. Can we please get some road course ringers in here so that this doesn't happen? Holy smokes. And again, I guess I'm the cause of the yellow. Uh. Okay, lots of cars pitted that time. We'll restart 28th. Quite a few cars behind us, quite a few cars ahead of us. This is probably about the worst position I could possibly be in. But we're about to go back to the racing here. Next to Regan Smith, the best road racer in NASCAR. I say sarcastically, green about to come back out. There it is, we're underway. Oh, I don't want to be on the outside of this. I do not want to be on the outside of this. So I'll jump to the inside of everybody. Break so early, break so early. Getting the Levante. Uh-oh. Really? Totally my fault. Totally my fault. I tied Dylan there and took out Harvick, who's a chase contender. Oh boy. So I've absolutely slam banged my way to the front, but I'm going to restart 12th. Hopefully we can actually get clean and green here for a little while. Starting next to uh, that car, the car that I like so much, the Sport Clips car ahead. Waltrip uh, going to be a good restart, hopefully this time. And we are go. We are green back out at Watkins Glen. Short shifted into second there, probably not the best decision next to Waltrip. Got to break early because everybody else is breaking early. In a second. Don't cause a crash. Don't cause a crash. There we go. There we go. Got her stopped and got into the S's side by side. I'll let Stewart go. I'll let Vickers go. I'll let Waltrip go. Oh, no. Oh, that was so cool. Oh, God. Oh. Really? I... Wow, I'm so sorry. Uh, we haven't even gotten one green lap in yet, and it's all my fault. I am so, so sorry. Oh, what? Let's do this. Alright, since I'm going to be restarting near the back or last anyway, I figure I'd come in and uh, take tires and fuel for the first time during this race. Pretty cool, uh, different animation here, except for the fact that it just lagged out, but, you know, whatever. 
Okay, about to come back to the green and absolutely stone dead last. But hopefully this time uh, we can be clean and green. And I've said that about three times and we're already halfway through this race somehow. Uh, this seems like a really short race. Maybe I should have kicked up the uh, the length of it. But uh, regardless, green flag is going. And here we go. Danica did not get a very good start. Neither did Clint Boyer or Tony Stewart. Casey Mears isn't going. Nobody's going. Everybody's breaking. Oh, please don't wreck. Wow. Crazy, crazy restart here. And we're back. Oh, are you kidding me? Yellow flag, yellow flag. No way. No way. Just, wow. This is awful. <laughs> this is awful. Boys, here we go. And because, of course, my car had damage, we're back in the pits immediately. Uh, you know, if we could go green for a full lap, uh, maybe I could stretch the rest of the way. Who knows what could happen. I'm just waiting for the game to crash, and somehow it's not. Thank goodness. I think a few cars just haven't even pitted. I think Keselowski has not even made a, a pit stop yet, which uh, wouldn't surprise me. I mean, we run practically the entire race under the caution, but that's going to change. The green flag is about to come out with seven laps to go. Hopefully we can actually run one of these under the green. This is like the New Orleans IndyCar race, except for it's not raining. And, uh, yeah, so here we go. Green flag. Back out. The leader is four seconds in front. Banzai! Three wide. You're in the middle. Wow, that was stupid. Again! Again! Going to caution. Going to caution. I don't even know what to say anymore. I don't even know what to say. Okay, about to come back to the green in 29th place for the 7th time? 8th time? ninth time? Something like that. Uh, 5 laps to go. Uh, this race has gone by incredibly quickly. Uh, but here we go. Back to the green. About to go. And we're going. We got this, buddy. Now we are going. And once again, a really good start. I'm going to break super, super early this time. Still not early enough. I still got into McDowell. Oh, come on. Just let me get through this. Let me get through this first section here. In fact, let's get a lap in. The goal is to get a lap. I'm going to let him do that. Into fourth gear, I fall into 30th, but that's okay. We're still clean and green. Gotta just be smooth, calm, 10-4. Car in front, heading to the Absolute pit. insanity in front of me. To the lead car. Into the carousel. Three wide. Little bit, little bit of a corner cut there. It's not gonna give me a penalty for it, thankfully. into this corner. Oh, gonna go a little wide on the exit. No harm, no foul. Thankfully no time penalty. Car is already pulling off into the pits. Three wide out of the final corner. Nice work, man. And we've completed a lap under green, folks. Yay! So, we can get the race underway, finally. Bobby Labonte slides out. Stenhouse, Bush ahead. He's charging. Got a little loose through the, the S's. Lost some time, did not He's get a very him. good run. Down here into the chicane. Car inside, just like Dane, who wanted Indianapolis, trying to go around the outside or the inside. It's kind of up in the air to decide which uh, which side it is uh, on, a, on a chicane like that. There's left, right, left, right, all uh, crazy nonsense. Oh, we're all, oh, I forgot to shift. That'll help. Almarola got around me for 28th. Try to return the favor. Cannot do it.
Oh, on the inside and I get into him. Is it gonna be a yellow? Oh! Well, we got a lap of green. Wow, he just freaked out and spun and got into the safer barrier and stopped. Wow. A metric butt ton of cars went into the pits that time. Uh, I'll restart seventh with one lap to go? Okay, this is the strangest NASCAR 15 race ever, but somehow I have a shot at the win! Okay, coming to the green. green flag about to come out, Chase Elliott and Brad Keselowski on the front row! We're underway! The leader's a second ahead. The leader's right there. And into second! Chasing down Brad Keselowski, what?! Ooh, lock the brakes up a little bit. Gordon's catching. Suddenly, all this shenanigans, I'm right in the thick of it. Car front's heading to the pit. Are you kidding me? No. Oh, I got, I got so confused when I heard that car was heading into the pits. Now I got passed by absolutely everybody. Dang. Let me in, Danica. Let me in. How many cars are coming into the pits? There's Almarola. Cars locking the brakes up. How many peeling, peeling off? Just Keselowski. Oh, and Hamlin really slow. White flag is out. Gordon leads. Trying to gain my positions back here that I lost. Screwing up. Oh boy. This is tense. Should not have clipped that curve. That was a bad idea. Got to see what I can do in the bus stop here. Oh, I, I'm in sandwich between the two Cheerios cars. Oh, I'm so confused. Watch your inside. Oh no, don't give me a time penalty. Oh, Danica. Oh, Danica. Car behind. No! No! Okay, let's go get him. We gotta go to work now. Danica, to you! Work. Oh Probably no! Huge crash! Stenhouse, no! You cannot be serious. Come on, why isn't it going? You cannot be serious. Oh. 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 Just one of those days, buddy. Don't worry. Keep your chin up. I can't even believe that just happened. Oh, man. So much promise. What a lousy way to end it. Oh, man, that's crushing. That's a crushing defeat. Oh, I'm really sad about that. I was there. I had the race in hand. I had the race in hand. I had it won. And Danica got into me on the last lap. Come home 42nd. Brad Keselowski, probably an even more crushing defeat. Led all the most laps but comes up empty-handed. What a strange race at Watkins Glen. Um, <laughs> uh, that, that killed my chase hopes, probably. Yeah, I definitely killed my chase hopes. Uh, dang. Well, Darlington will be fun. The rest of the season will just be fun. I'll still keep track of the points so you guys will be able to figure out uh, what's going on with the chase and we'll have some storylines and interesting things to watch out for but man this is a crushing defeat uh, well this was Watkins Glen it was an absolute wreck fest 
and disappointing at the very end when I had the win in the bag. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like on the video. And hopefully Darlington's a little bit more fun and less wrecks than this. But uh, who knows? We'll see you at Darlington.